Let me see it. Can you look scared? Come on, shake like a chihuahua. Hey! hey! I need to talk. <laughs> yeah, you need something. Oh, you look worse every time I see you. What are you wearing? Uh, ooh, desperate for men? You're just as desperate as I am, Lizzie. <sighs> yeah? Well, at least my shoes are new, and I've had a manicure and a pedicure. Great. Beautiful. Now let's talk about something important, like getting that tool away from Tammy. Joey's not a tool, Jonathan. Sorry, but... Okay, I'm working on something that might help both of us. Might? Not good enough. Probably. How's that? You know Lou, my pet snake? Yeah. He has a dream. <laughs> what dream? This. For dinner. <laughs> mm, I can't wait. We're living off of bar food. That's what I hear. Wait, one second. I also hear Jonathan has a place outside of town. Yeah, outskirts. Yeah, no offense, Tammy, but uh, guy comes off like he's got a major chip on his shoulder. Not the type of guy I pictured you with. I'm not with him. Not anymore. Let's not talk about him, okay? okay. Joey Lupo? <laughs> <laughs> when did you get back? I'm, I'm not. I'm just visiting. It's great to see you, Mrs. Winslow. <laughs> I'm guessing it'd be even greater if I just said hello and then made myself scarce, huh? Oh. Okay, okay. I'm going. I just... Well, it's great to see you. And you just keep her out as late as you want. Thanks. There are no curfews anymore, right? Mom! Okay, I'm going. Guess she approves this time. If it matters. Maybe it does. Maybe all of that does matter now. Romeo, Romeo, wherefore art thou Romeo? I look around, you're nowhere to be seen. And then Lizzie yells out, he's in the loo! <laughs> Did yell out, he's in the loo. <laughs> Those rehearsals were a lot of fun, but mainly because I got to spend time with you, which you do know is the only reason why I took that part, right? I knew that. Did you? Did you also know about Shane? How you used to give me lines to say to you, which is obviously why I came off so suave and worldly. <laughs> All right, I tried. I did try. Well, you were cute. Very cute. I knew your heart wasn't in doing that play, though. Remember that one time that Sam... You're gonna say Sandy. I heard about the accident. I can't believe he's gone. He was a good guy. But happy memories, right? You remember that time that we were directing and he's like trying to figure out what's going... Joey, I can't... I can't talk about him. Okay. I'm... I'm sorry. I, I just... I don't know any details about anything, so... We'll just leave it like that, okay? Thank you. Do you hear what I hear? I can't believe this. We danced this at the prom, didn't we? <laughs> Shall we? <sighs> you feel good. You too. Oh, it's like we're right back in high school. It's like no time has passed at all. Like everything that's happened didn't. It's lucky I ran into you. Yeah, lucky. <laughs> luck, luck, luck didn't really have anything to do with it. <clears throat> I have a confession to make. I planned this whole trip. I, I, I had to see you. Were well, you... Did, did, but why? Why look, now? I found out that you were gonna get married and something happened in the last minute and... Tammy... The truth is... I have never stopped loving you. And that's why I'm here. As long as we understand each other. As long as you understand? No, we're not scared of you. We both know he's gone soft, right, girl? The hell are you talking about? Jonathan, you saw Joey and Tammy, and what'd you do? Oh, you did nothing. What am I supposed to do, burn down the building? Uh, yeah, it wouldn't be a first time. God, what happened to 
the guy who seduced Tammy to get back at his mom? Where is the guy who helped me drug my boyfriend so I could get him into bed? You know what? Tammy has tamed you. No. Mm -hmm. I just have things a little more under control right oh, now. Oh, you don't even have your hair under control. You are too scared to fight the way you used to because you don't want to alienate Tammy. And you don't want to push her further away. No, I'm not scared. I have tickets for us to get out of town, just the two of us. If I can get her alone, which I've not been able to do. Well, then do something about it. <laughs> Since when did you get so moral? Be the guy that you were. Be the guy that had no problem helping me drug my boyfriend. What are you suggesting, that I drug Tammy? Drug Tammy. I would never suggest something so drastic. Okay, come on, like, muss me up or something. I need to look a little bit, uh, well, a little bit more like you. Never mind. Forget about you, yeah. No, Tammy, you're not too easy to forget about. And looking at you now in this dress and your hair, it's, it's, it's like we're back behind the curtains during rehearsal trying to kiss each other. <laughs> I can't believe nobody got us looking up like that. I never cared. Hey. Hey. <laughs> and then all those rehearsals. Remember that rehearsal where we all decided to skip and we showed up and Sandy made us drop to the floor? Every time I say his name, what is it? There are things that you don't know about me. I'm not that girl anymore, the one that you keep talking about. I mean, you are, only better. Because you don't know. Know what? The night of the accident, I was there. I was... I'm sorry. That's really horrible, I'm so sorry. Me too. Joey, I want more than anything to be that girl that you went to school with. The one who played Juliet and cheered you on at your baseball games. But I'm not that girl anymore. I've changed. I don't even think I deserve someone like you. Tammy, you are that girl. You're everything that that girl embodies. And more. Do you really mean that? Of course I do. Thank you. I live here. Couldn't stay away. I thought you were supposed to have a big date tonight. What's his name? I did. It was fun. Joey's a great guy. He's so funny and 
decent and caring. We have a lot of memories together. Good memories. When I'm with him, I feel... You feel what? Like my old self. As opposed to... When you're with me, you feel like... Your damaged self. I didn't say that. Why did you come here, Tammy? Did you come here to torture me? I told Joey I wanted to go home with him tonight. <sighs> I didn't want the night to end. So we got in the elevator and we headed down and... It hit me, you know? I couldn't do it, Jonathan. I couldn't be anywhere except for right here with you. You walked away. Here I am. You were right, Jonathan. You do own me. And I own you, and I just can't run from that. Whatever we have or don't have, I can't run anymore. This is wrong in every possible way. You turned my life upside down. Is that a bad thing? I had it all back, Jonathan. My mom, school, <laughs> even my old boyfriend. The future looked like it used to, like it's supposed to. Supposed to doesn't mean anything. You're my future. And all that is nothing compared to this. I love you, Jonathan. I didn't even know if you would be here, but I had to try. <laughs> is that mine? It is. Were you packing me up? I thought that you weren't coming back. I, um, I thought that I'd have to let you go, you What's know? What's that? Tammy, wait. Tickets? <sighs> oh, my God. Tickets. Drugs. That's why you were packing me up, isn't it? You were going to knock me out and take me away. I would never put anything in your drink. Where did you get those drugs? What were you doing with those tickets? Look, I talked to Lizzie, and for a second, it crossed my mind. It crossed your mind? Like you were going to do it? Yeah, look, for a desperate oh, second, God. but then it stopped. Tammy, come on. I would never oh. hurt you. You have to know that by now. I can't do this, Jonathan. I cannot live like this anymore. Okay, okay, okay. Okay, okay. Look, look, look. I made a mistake, okay? But I'm sorry. We need each other. I cannot afford to need you. What's going to happen next time? There won't be a next time. You are right about that. No. Tammy, I love you. I love you, too. I always will. Tammy. Tammy, don't go. Don't go. Don't go. Don't go. Goodbye, Jonathan. Come on. Tammy! 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 